Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of PMAT 2000. In previous two episodes, we saw basic functioning and installation of software in PMAT 2000. Link is in description. In this episode, we will see how to upload software from PMAT to aircraft LRU. As per YouTube analytics, 70% of our viewers have not subscribed the channel yet. So if you are one of them, then please subscribe the channel and press bell icon for notification. It will really motivate us for making such video content. Let's get our video started. Software comes in two different format, PDL615 and Arring615 Alpha, which is LAN enable. First let us see PDL615. We'll click on 615 data loading and then we'll click on PMAT2000 mass storage because our software has already been uploaded in this. Now here we will select our aircraft model, then the tail on which we are uploading, we'll select LRU over here and the part number of the software we'll select over here. Then we will click on select. Here we will write our operator name and then we will click on start load. It is validating our part number, we will click on start load again. Here is photo of our old type loader. On left side you can see three indicator lights. In this big screen they will show you number of disks. Here we will see the file name which is being uploaded. On right side we will see all the detail of the software and here we will see transmission and receiver words per second. When the software starts uploading we will get a green light over here in ready. In this file name it will keep on changing the file. Some file may take longer time. See to it that we always get some words per second in transmission and receiving. Once disk 1 is completed, contains from disk 2 will start uploading automatically. Load complete, so we will click on review. Then we will click on finish. Now we will see how to upload software which is in 615 alpha format, which is LAN enable. So we will click on 615 alpha first. In number 1 you will write your username, in number 2 you will select your tail number, in number 3 you will select connection type as per your LRU, then you will click on continue. Right now we are uploading software so we will click on upload. Now PMAT is looking for the target LRU, at this moment you have to push in the CB so that LRU boots up and is ready for taking the upload. So it found our target FMGC, we'll click on it and then continue. Here we will select internal mass storage disk. We'll select our tail over here and all the part number which is available in MSD will be shown over here. We'll select as per our requirement and then we'll click on continue. It is validating our part numbers, we'll click on OK. Here we will select load serial number also and then we will click on continue upload. Uploading started, state is connecting to the target, now it is in progress. So as we progress we will get a progress bar over here in blue color and when it is completed we will get it in green color. Upload completed. Here you can check all the details whether the software was uploaded correctly or not. We'll click on close button and then go back. 